Hi, this is Pete from FMI Enterprises. I'm an auto dealer here in Southern California. Today I have for you a beautiful looking 2004 Ford Thunderbird with 191,000 original miles. Car does have some miles on it, but uh, it does look nice. Paint's in good shape. Nice and shiny. Top is in good shape, goes up and down just fine. No rips or tears in the material. Back window is nice and solid. Wheels look good. Got a good set of tires on it. Front and rear. Interior is very clean. Seats don't have any rips or tears. Look very good. And uh, so I'm going to walk around and give you guys a detailed condition report to let you know what I see firsthand. Um, first off with the paint, <clears throat> as I said, the paint's in good shape. It's not perfect, um, but it does look good. Um, if you look closely, you will notice some tiny little rock nicks on the front bumper. Um, there's a little crack right here in the lower part of the bumper, just this edge, front edge right there on that side other than that it looks pretty good and that's out of sight that little crack um, front bumper overall looks pretty nice the hood looks good there's a little spot of clear coat just on the edge of this little hood scoop right here that um, you don't see from far away but just want to point it out um, Left front fender looks good. No dents or dings. The emblems all look pretty good on this car and the chrome. The door, driver's side door looks good. The left rear quarter fender looks nice. Tiny little, little door ding right there. Very small. Thunderbird emblem looks good. <clears throat> The top of the the uh, trunk here, there's a little bit of checking on the paint. These little little bit of clear coat spots right there. Um, just a, a, a couple. It's not super bad. But um, just that little spot over there. A couple little, little check spots right here. Doesn't look horribly bad, but, you know, I want to point it out. Um, the right fender right rear quarter fender looks good there's a little bump right here a little scratch right there in the lower part of the bumper um, current California registration April 2019 <clears throat> California car as you can see the exhaust is nice and clean rust free Tail lights look good, no cracks. Headlights look good, no cracks. Could use a good polishing, but um, it's pretty easy to do. The uh, right door, nice and clean. Right front fender looks good. So overall, I think the paint, probably about an eight out of a 10, easy, I mean, couple little things down low that you don't notice but I mean it the car looks really good it's I mean somebody sees you in this car and it it the car looks really nice so it's probably better than an eight but just to be conservative on that I don't want to break anybody's heart um, it's not a brand new car it's got 191,000 miles so please keep that in mind but um, it does look good uh, the glass is in good shape Got a small little star right there, very, very tiny out of sight. Um, top, like I said, in good condition, no rips or tears in the top. It, it's a power top, it goes up and down perfectly fine, no problems, which I'll demonstrate in a minute. Uh, the wheels all look very nice. It's got a good set of uh, Continental Contra Contact tour, uh, Touring Contact. AS tires and these are uh, 17 inch 
And you can see the tread here looks just about brand new. And that's, you can see there's no rash on these, on these wheels, nice and clean. And this one looks brand new as well. So these tires were most likely just changed. This one looks excellent. And the tire, brand new all the way across. And this one as well, a little spot of rash right there. Uh, but overall, pretty clean. <sighs> Underneath the car, I'm looking under here, looks pretty dry, a little bit of oil, but uh, you know, it's an old car, and uh, not so bad. So the car has a clear auto check with no accidents on it. And uh, that's it for the exterior. So let's talk about the interior. Interior, as I said, looks very nice. The seats, nice and clean. The material, leather material is in good shape. No rips or tears in it. It's a power seat here, forward, back. It's got all the controls here. Like a six position seat, I believe it is. Passenger seat's in excellent shape as well. Nothing wrong with that seat, looks very good. Armrest, you know, it's not all ripped up. The car has a lot of miles, but I mean, it doesn't seem like it's destroyed or ripped up. I've got this here. It's actually in pretty decent shape. I've seen much worse uh, for cars with less miles. You see the shifter's in good shape. <clears throat> Carpeting has the original floor mats. Floor mats are in nice shape, no holes, and the uh, carpeting underneath looks good. It's got a little heel hole up there in the front corner, you'll notice. But other than that, the carpet looks very nice. <clears throat> carpeting over here looks excellent. And underneath looks brand new. Dash perfect shape steering wheel looks good it's got the uh, buttons here for the uh, mute for your phone and your cruise control on the wheel um, it's got a little little chip right there in the top of the paint on the steering wheel but uh, overall it <clears throat> it's pretty smooth even so it's not not uh, too annoying um, glove box looks good and here I've got the uh, Looks to be an owner's manual. Yes, it is. Owner's guide and the book. Glove box is in good shape. Click shut. Door panels both look excellent. Um, both power windows work. Door locks. Keyless entry works good. <clears throat> Trunk. good shape got the uh, little cargo net that came with it um, as well as this um, little bag here that's attached to the cargo net anyway we'll put that up here I've got some uh, Ford instruction sheet right here for the cargo net that's what this is and a little bag that it came with um, other than that the um, trunk looks very nice And under here, of course, we have the uh, spare tire in good shape. <clears throat> the battery is in good shape. It's a, it's a motorcraft, Ford motorcraft battery. And uh, it's all there. So as I said, um, the alarm, keyless entry alarm works. Hit the button. And the alarm does work. As I found out the hard way last night, it comes with two, uh, two fobs. The little, the little hook there is broken on this, but you can buy these, just the, the case on eBay for about five bucks and replace the guts and it'll work just fine. 
car fires right up. Runs good. Um, occasionally at startup, it has like a, you get a little rattle from the engine just for like two seconds, um, which goes away. And then it seems to run pretty well. Um, I noticed a little bit of lift, a little bit of lifter noise, but not too bad. So, I mean, it's not a brand new car. Please don't expect that. It's, you know, not a brand new engine, not a brand new transmission or anything, but um, the car does run and drive pretty good. You see the struts hold the hood up just fine. It's a V8. Uh, power steering, power brakes, traction control. So, might as well show you how the top works. So, what you do is you push this down here, then you find the convertible top open button here. Hold it down. Just like that. So, that all works very well and it goes up fine, is, uh, no problem going up. Um, here you've got heated seats. which the lights aren't coming on, but uh, I'm not sure if that's working or not. Um, radio sounds good. KLOS. Yeah, too early in the morning for that song. Um, and the AC blows nice and cold. Turn the AC on, blows cold. Heater blows warm. It's got dual climate control there. Turn that off. Six disc CD changer. Um, what else? You can see the odometer here is 191, 173. So the heated seat is on right now. So I confirm that that is working. Um, turn that off. E brake works good. You can see the boots in nice condition on the e brake and the handle. It's in good shape. And behind the seat as well looks nice the rear shelf area back here behind the seats looks nice and clean visors both here in good shape got your dome lights up here your reading lights that is like an airplane just kind of swivel around so they work good it's a uh, Definitely this heated seat is on, but the uh, lights aren't turning on, so hopefully that turns it off. Uh, you got a traction control button down here that you push, and then the uh, traction light should come on. There it is. There's the lights on there that it's showing you that it's off. I'll turn that on. And let's take a ride. Front end uh, feels pretty pretty solid. It's a little bit creaky up front, so it may be <laughs> excuse me. Maybe the um, struts are a little bit creaky, or the uh, bushings up front, but um, drives fine. Drives and handles just fine. <laughs> Transmission shifts good. Occasionally you get a little bit of a, uh, a hard shift going into second. And it probably happens maybe about 5% of the time. It's, it's not really that bad. Um, but just pointing it, at, pointing it out. As I said, it has a near new set of tires on it. Good set of brakes. Um, it's got uh, telescopic power uh, steering wheel. Comes out, goes in. All the uh, directions work as they should on that. So get going here. So the car drives, I'm, I'm going about six, 60 miles an hour right now. As you can see, the car drives nice, nice and straight. <coughs> 
nice and straight. The steering wheel is not bumping around or anything. So it's a pretty smooth driver. Turn signals work. And that's about it. So I think I covered just about everything. Uh, it's a pretty nice car. It's got 191,000 miles. It's not brand new. Um, it's got some small issues that, you know, you could live with and drive it for the summer if you wanted and uh, enjoy the car. But if you need something perfect, you know, you can always go and spend spend some more money and buy something like that. But, um, you know, the car as it sits, it, I think it looks good. It uh, drives pretty good. It's got, um, like I said, it's got a, some creaks and some little, little noises here and there. Um, but it does run and drive good. I've got no check engine lights on the odometer. Um, and that's about it. You know, it's it's a nice little car. Clear clear auto check, no accidents on the auto check. I don't think I showed this door panel. You can see just you know all around the car, it's in pretty nice shape. I think it this heated seat is on as well. Okay, there's the light by the way. So the light does work. There, it's off. And mine is off. So the light does work. It's just very dim. And that's it. So <clears throat> call me if you have any questions. And uh, that's all, folks.